In the land of the free and the home of the brave. There, now we, now we can get this video thing started here. So, I want to start out by thanking Mr. Neil Moore for letting me use his channel to do a video. I love that geocaching. It's so much fun. I see everybody out geocaching and watching videos. And now I want to do a video like my friend uh, down in Georgia, Stardust ZZZ. Uh, she does some videos on opening up her mail and some pad tags and and some and then her and the GC Doc. He's so he's so good. He, he's a good daddy with them their kids. He is a good daddy and they do those unboxing things they buy geocaching stuff and they get a box of stuff and I only make a little bit of money down at the refinery so I just gotta make had to make do I got on the old internet and then I found me a little bit cheaper place to get me some geocaching supplies and stuff so I'm gonna do me an unboxing of what I got from them and then I got some mail right here now I'm gonna do this one first this is my mail right here you can see right there it says it says Bob Belly first trailer on the right past rubies <laughs> that's right that's where I live is the first trailer on the right just past rubies it's a it's a nice place here let me show you a picture of it right here this is where I live at 3434 corner and it, yep, that's my mailbox right there. You can see my mailbox right there. Yep. So now I'm going to open up this here package. And I don't know if you saw that video that I was in with Mr. Hellmeister, that celebrity geocaching. He had that geocaching with Hellmeister t-shirt. And I wanted one so bad. Yep. It, so I went, I bought me one. <laughs> I did. I bought me one. Oh, and isn't it a pretty blue? It's such a pretty blue right there. Geocaching with Hellmeister. It's a beep, stop my video. <laughs> beep, stop my video right there, yeah. So, I bought me this here Geocaching with Hellmeister t shirt. So, I, next time I see Mr. Hellmeister, I can be just like him. And I ought to put it, I ought to put it on right now. So, let me get, I'm going to put it on. Yeah, I'm going to. Uh. Oh, it fits me. It fits me like a glove. I'm so proud of this year. I'm about to cry. It, isn't it beautiful? It's a beautiful shade of blue like the blue sky above. That's not all I got. I got I got my geocaching stuff from my the website that I found. Here it is. It's my caching crap. It's a box of geocaching stuff. I love I love geocaching. I don't know how many times I got to tell you, I love geocaching. They got some tape on there. Find me a knife here. So, I'm going to cut this here box open. Let's see if I can get this open here. Oh, oh that, it's alright. It's just my leg. It don't, it don't hurt much. I got me a Kleenex around here someplace I can put on that. There we go. Nothing like a good sharp knife to help you out. Oh, that, mm, that smarts are just a little bit. Look, I'm just going to reach inside the box, just like Miss Jamie does. Oh, there's the paper. I got. I'm not going to look at the paper. I take that out, throw that away. I'm going to reach in and find out what's first. What is, what is this? Oh, it's a baggie. It, you know, you put your logs in this. Isn't that? Oh, and it's a fine baggie, and it's coming out of my cash and crap box, and isn't that a fine? That is so nice. It even still zips shut, and you still have a second way to get the log in there. It's nice. That's nice. That's, I'm going to use this on my next deal catch. Let's look. Let's, let's reach in the box again. What do we got here? Oh, oh what is this? Oh, oh yeah, this is awesome. This is uh, a restaurant receipt. 
And this is from a local place here called the Swan Inn Restaurant. It's a nice place. You can get in there, you can get a four piece chicken dinner for $8.99. And it comes with a real mashed potatoes, none of that box stuff. But this is a receipt. This is like emergency log stuff that, you know, when you get there and the log is all wet and soggy and you can't write on it. This, these come in so handy. I'm just going to put that right in my wallet so next time I come across a wet log, I don't have to put a needs maintenance or needs archive and I can just put a new log in there. I'll put a, a link below to the, to the, the cash and crap website so you can get you a good quality cash and crap like I did. It only cost you like two dollars a month. Let's see what else we got in here. Oh, oh yeah. This is a, oh it's a used scotch bright pad. You know what these are good for? These good for cleaning your glasses. Now they're only good for taking the dirt and the crud off the geocache. Especially when you find one in the woods that a raccoon has decided to deposit his Last night's dinner on, you know what I mean? You can kind of scrub it off in there. That's right. That's that's a good one. And then, oh, and look at that. I can put that right here in this little log bag right along with that log. Right there. That, that works good. Now let's see what. Oh, this is awesome. This is awesome. It's a deer antler. If you could tie a uh, one of those little plastic tubes or a film canister to that, and you could have you a a sneaky, sneaky, sneaky hide out in the woods because people will walk right by this and go, look at that, there's a deer antler laying there, I, but I cannot find my geocache. But there it is. It's a tricky, tricky, tricky hide. It is right there. Think, but, oh, we got one last thing. Oh, it's a rock. It's an awesome rock. It's not even a hide key. It's just a rock. This makes awesome swag when you going to, and you find those little sandwich containers and it's packed full of those McDonald's toys you can throw them all out and you can put in this rock and this is awesome look how shiny that rock is it is awesome well I think that is that it well folks I want you to remember if you want some good geocaching crap you need to go to the Catch and Crap and get you a, a monthly box subscription. So remember, Catch and Crap, it's awesome. I want to thank my good friend Mr. Neil for letting me do this here video on his equipment. And I want to thank y'all for letting me join you in your homes. So we'll see you next time on Bob Billy the Redneck Geocatcher.